Hey there! So today we're here to talk about Project You're Awesome, which is a campaign that helps bring together YouTubers to donate to lots of different charities. And our charity is called Girl Rising. It's a movement to educate women and girls around the world to help improve and empower their lives and help their families and communities and the country as a whole. Here in the United States, we often take education for granted, both as women and just as people in general, because it's something that we just automatically get here. And it's something that we are expected to do, and almost everyone we know has gone to college or is in college or will go to college someday. And everyone just has the opportunity to go to college. <laughs> However, many other countries don't have these sorts of opportunities for girls. All women deserve to receive an education if they want, or maybe even if they don't want, because it would really be helpful. A lot of girls receive little to no education, and we really want to stop that. If you educate women, you can change the world. So right now, women and girls are less educated than boys globally. Either they don't finish school past primary school, or they just never really got the chance to go to primary school. On top of this, girls tend to be married off younger than boys are, and they're getting married off when they're still basically children, or still actually are children. But countries that provide secondary education to women allow them to go off and learn more about themselves and get an education before they get forced into a marriage. And when women are educated, they can help with environmental problems in their country, they can help reduce the hunger problem around the world, and they can help with political movements through equal rights, which is really important. Education is power. It gives confidence and freedom, it improves health, and it improves your future. So you might be wondering, why women? But a lot of countries have a much easier time dealing with issues that are in their country or surrounding their country when women are educated. It's a lot easier and a lot faster than when someone else comes in and says, oh, I know how to fix all your problems. If a woman is educated, then a lot of the times they know how to make a difference themselves and they can bring up the issues and think of really cool ideas that maybe other people might not have thought of and they're right there so they have a really good position. So basically, it's either you have 50% of your population educated enough to actually help or you have 100%. Which one's better? Probably 100. <laughs> so we thought it might be a good idea to let you know some famous women who have impacted our history in a way that maybe would not have happened if they didn't have education. One is Oprah Winfrey. Another is Indira Gandhi. Another is Michelle Obama. Jane Austen. J.K. Rowling. Marie Curry. Jane Goodall. We all know of another very recent example of someone who has fought for education because she was not having the equal opportunity to get her own education. That is Malala Yousafzai. She shouldn't have to fight for her education. It no. should just be a right that everyone has to be able to become educated. Mm -hmm. If they hadn't gotten that education and thus been able to impact history, our lives would all be pretty different right now. So, if you're interested in getting involved in this cause, you can watch the Girl Rising movie, you can donate directly to Girl Rising, we will leave a link in the doobly-doo, or you can donate through Project for Awesome. If you want to donate directly to Project for Awesome, then there's a lot of really cool charities out there that people are really passionate about, and so if you don't want to donate to Girl Rising, I really recommend that you at least do that. Yeah, let's decrease world suck, guys. Let's do it! Bye! Bye!